Well, everyone's been wondering what the hell I've been doing for the last five or six days. No videos? That's unusual. Well, I've been cleaning. Priorities, you know. My borrowed truck, borrowed trailer, and my poor Subi. I love that car. Well, motor still runs perfect, but no power steering. Never did have any. The clutch is totally worn out by visiting YouTuber who mudded it and got it stuck. And reverse gear only works the odd time. So, oh well, off to the scrapyard. She'll be on the trailer in just a moment. Poor thing. This is how we put them on. It's really simple. Lift them up, back under halfway, and we're ready. Perfect. Now my turn to load her. Well, he holds the brake so we don't break park on the truck by shoving everything. Done deal. Well, maybe the end of the legacy, but not the end of David's farm. And there's what else I've been up to. Well, Rick had the best time of his life destroying that trailer with the backhoe, and I've hired in a great big dumpster to put it all in and pay to get rid of it. Nobody would take that stupid motor home for free because it costs more to dump that waste than the value of the frame and steel that it's made out of. Oh well. Well, the Subaru marks the 39th car to leave Dave's farm for good in the last three weeks. Oh well. Well, this legacy ends here. A YouTuber's dream. Joyriders everywhere. Sweet. Too bad they don't have enough room here to have fun. All they do is work all day. That sucks. Those days are over for me. And off to the scale. There's one of the crushers. Oh, and it looks like a 72 Ford Maverick. Huh, <laughs> not bad shape. Come on, yeah! Day's farm destruction. I trained him well. This place is also the new home of the White Redneck Roller Coaster. Done the final way. Let's get ourselves out of here and get back home for a beer. Hey, they haven't even crushed her yet and she's been there three days. There's my White Redneck Roller Coaster with missing decals. I saved those. You'll see what's coming up. Well, I also saved the attachment for a future Redneck Roller Coaster, of course. Canada's most famous car, you know. Nothing but death and destruction and carnage. Hmm, gotta love it. And a couple Toyota pickups. Oh, 
<laughs> sorry sight. And there's the now dead Celebra City too. A 1990 wagon with the Eurosport. Still running great, but too messed up to play with. And that's what it last looked like at my farm. And recognize that thing? The Hot Rod Mercury. And the red one. Well, that's enough. Beer money to last me for a couple of weeks. Subi weighed uh, 2,420 pounds with no wheels and gas tank. Well, maybe I'll save some of it for a lawyer. Well, I mean, my lawyers. <laughs>